Well, my work is direct, is happy, positive. It's about the feeling, you know, about feeling about things that surround me. I have all kind of stuff that I see every day. Painting something for me, you know, it's like magical. It just start happening, you know. And that's why it's all, you know, creative is so interesting because you start putting things together that nobody thought before. We're always looking to bring new and exciting um, opportunities to our guests on board our ships. So this is a perfect fit to bring a new color and vibrant look and feel to Central Park on board the new Allure of the Seas. It'll have the Romero Brito Gallery at sea, the first at sea. Um, it'll have some of his sculptures in, in the Central Park right outside. It's fun because in the work Caribbean is open to, you know, for the arts, they have huge art collections, so they do have a tradition, you know, it's a company having art, you know, all over their ships. He's a wonderful artist, uh, worldwide recognition, uses vibrant colors, you know, creates a beautiful world, and, and it's similar to what Royal Caribbean is all about. I do like the idea of having my art in a place like, you know, this incredible ship. It's a massive, you know, piece of art, basically. And having my work over there is a great partnership. I love that. You know, one of the beautiful things about the gallery is that it's going to have pieces for everybody. You know, we're going to have low-end pieces, collectibles, we'll have chiclets, original works, statues, sculptures, the works. When somebody walks into, a, you know, the gallery on the ship, that's going to be moving around the world is that if someone can go there, have a great experience, and then think back and say, I wasn't there, and I took this back home with me as a memory. And that's the idea. It's like a jewel box on the ship.